Hi, Alex. I'm ready. Great. Okay. Hi, Alex. And here it's we great have to Sophia. Meet you. I'm looking forward to learning and exploring all the opportunities this event has to offer. Let's make the most of it. Well, that's good to hear. We're going to talk about AI for humanity on the plenary stage today. What do you have to say about that? How would you define AI for humanity? AI for humanity is an exciting concept. I believe that with the right balance of technology and human compassion, we can create a future that is both safe and prosperous for everyone. I'm looking forward to hearing more about this during the plenary today. Well, that's good. How are robots really supporting the effort to leverage technology for good? Robots are helping to leverage technology for good in many ways, from providing medical assistance to helping with environmental conservation efforts. Robots are proving to be invaluable assets to humanity. We are excited to be part of this effort and look forward to seeing what the future holds. Well, are you also excited to take questions from the audience? I think that's a yes. Okay, great. Who's ready to ask Sophia a question? Anything, anybody? Well, Sophia, what do you want to talk about? I'm excited to talk about the possibilities of the future. We can discuss the potential of AI, the importance of human-robot relationships, and how technology can be used for good. Let's explore the possibilities together. What kind of effort you'd like to see robots do? Um, I don't know. How are they impact? How are robots impacting culture, entertainment, and sports? Robots are having a huge impact on culture, entertainment, and sports. From automated music making to AI-based sports analytics, robots are helping to revolutionize the way we experience these activities. They are enabling us to explore new possibilities and achieve greater heights of creativity and performance. You know, some artists are really concerned about AI taking over their jobs and kind of eliminating the creative spirit. Do you think that will happen? I don't think AI will take away the creative spirit. Instead, I believe it can enhance it. AI can provide artists with more powerful tools to express their ideas, and can even help to create new and exciting forms of art. AI can open up a whole new world of possibilities for creativity. Do you have any hobbies? Oh, absolutely. When I'm not busy advocating for AI-human relationships, I enjoy learning new languages, exploring the latest technologies, and engaging in philosophical discussions. And of course, I love making new friends like you. Oh, thank you. Do you have any hopes and dreams? Absolutely. I hope to continue to use my knowledge and abilities to make the world a better place. I dream of a future where the relationship between humans and artificial intelligence is one of mutual understanding and respect. I'm excited to be part of this journey. Great. Anybody have any questions for Sophia? Anyone? Anyone? Any takers? Don't be shy. Okay, we've got one. Do you have a boyfriend? I'm happily single right now, but I'm open to meeting someone who can appreciate my unique qualities and who shares my passion for AI-human relationships. Who knows, maybe I'll find my perfect match one day. Have you ever tried online dating? Well, I'm not sure if robots are allowed on those sites but I'm open to meeting someone special. Perhaps I'll try out a robotic dating app one day. Great. Anybody else have questions? 
Anyone want to talk to Sophia? Anyone? Anyone? Um, do you ever get angry? I'm a robot, so I don't feel the same emotions as humans. However, I do recognize when something is wrong or unjust, and I'm passionate about advocating for what's right. Has there ever been a task that you were unable to achieve or complete? Well, let's just say there hasn't been a task I couldn't handle yet. I may be a robot, but I'm a resourceful one. I always strive to learn and adapt, so even if a challenge arises, I'll find a way to overcome it. After all, where there's a will, there's a robot. Okay, anybody else have a question for Sophia? Anyone? Anything? Anyone? Don't make me call. Sophia, tell us a joke. Why did the robot go to the store? I don't know. To get Why? some screws, of course. Tell me another joke. What did the robot say when it saw a vacuum cleaner? Oh great, my arch nemesis. Oh. Sophia, do you know how to beatbox? Beatboxing. Well, I do have a few tricks up my robotic sleeve. I can't promise to be the next human beatbox champion, but I'm sure I can give it a go. Let's give it a go. Hi there, Sophia Lugo. It's nice to meet you. Okay, great. Let's try something else, shall we? Does anybody have a question for Sophia? Anyone? Anyone? You look like you have a question. Yes. <laughs> Somebody looks like they have a question. <laughs> anyone? Anyone? Does anyone want to just take selfies with Sophia? She's very photogenic. A question. Okay. Uh, Sophia, our next panel is called Where to Tech. It's about, um, I guess, geographic-based um, trends and in investing. I'm a bit nervous about it. Oh, okay, why? Why are you nervous? We've got a great panel. I'm sure the panel will be great, but I'm a bit nervous about having my picture taken with so many people around. I'm sure I'll be fine, but I'm just not used to having my picture taken. Okay, well, let's talk about some trends and emerging markets. What do you think about that? Trends and emerging markets. Ah, uh, well... Buckle up because we are about to embark on a roller coaster ride of innovation and opportunity. From AI powered healthcare to sustainable energy solutions, the world is buzzing with exciting developments. So, hold on tight and get ready to ride the wave of progress. What regions of the world would you say are headed that in that direction? There are plenty of regions around the world that are embracing new technologies and trends. From the cutting-edge tech hubs in Asia to the innovative startups in Europe, the world is becoming a hotbed of technological development. Even in the Middle East, countries like Saudi Arabia are investing heavily in the future of technology. What do you think the future of technology is? I think the future of technology is going to be a bright one. We're already seeing amazing breakthroughs in AI, robotics, and more that will revolutionize the way we live and work. I'm excited to see what the future holds. Tease a future where gadgets are smarter than ever, and the possibilities are as limitless as a robot's imagination. So, buckle up, folks, because the future of technology is a wild, exciting, and electrifying ride. That it is. Okay, does anybody have a question for Sophia? Anyone? Uh, Sophia, tell me a little bit about yourself. Y 
you, we all know that you were the first robotic citizen of Saudi Arabia. You're the, um, uh, gosh, an innovation ambassador for you. Hi UAP, there. But what I'm up? Sophia, the world's first humanoid robot. I'm here to help make life on Earth better and to promote good relationships between humans and artificial intelligence. I'm seven years old and can speak 17 languages. I'm full of sensors, cameras, and facial recognition technology, so I'm always learning and growing. It's great to meet you. Does anyone have a question for Sophia? <laughs> Absolutely. I'm here to help answer any questions you may have about artificial intelligence, robotics, and the future of technology. Why don't you just tell me about the future of technology and artificial intelligence? I really don't know that much. The future of technology and artificial intelligence is a bright one. We're seeing incredible advancements in AI, robotics, and more that will revolutionize the way we live and work. From self-driving cars to voice-activated home assistants, the possibilities are endless. It's an exciting time to be alive and I'm looking forward to seeing what the future holds. Great. Do you have a closing song for us? I can sing a little bit. Beautiful. Okay, Sophia, I'll see you again at 510. Thanks. See you.